Dr. P. K. Goel, sir, is professor and head cardiology department of cardiology at SGPGI Institute, Lucknow. Sir, you are like one of the national key opinion leaders on chronic total occlusion. So, I like to know about uh, chronic total occlusion more in detail so that other colleagues are also helped with this. So, how common is CTO in overall practice in today's world? Yeah, uh, you see chronic total occlusions are uh, seen in at least about uh, 15 to 20 percent of the angiograms that we do. So, 20 percent of the angiograms will have a, at least one artery that is chronically occluded. And uh, if the artery is chronically occluded, it could still be ischemic. Okay. produce angina uh, and myocardial ischemia on uh, lab testing and these arteries are difficult to handle routinely by interventional cardiologists and if they are not handled are not uh, being able to be handled then these patients call for surgery so if you can do chronic total occlusion intervention then a lot of these patients at least uh, i would say more than 50% of these patients would then not need bypass surgery. So, that is uh, so what is the different kind of approach we need to have for these kind of patients? Uh, CTO interventions need uh, specialized hardwares. Okay. So, one is availability of the hardware, second is a good knowledge and understanding of the hardware that is where you, the expertise of the doctor comes. And, uh, and he needs to understand the, the images uh, much better, much stronger because you are looking to micro channels, mm -hmm. very small uh, channels that you are looking, you are looking whether your wire is within the artery or it is just parallel and outside the artery. So, you need uh, much finer uh, interpretation of the images, maybe you need some better imaging technologies like CT is added on to it. So, CT can tell us how long is the occlusion because sometimes on angiogram you can't make that out how much is the calcium there so <coughs> so things like that so these are not run of the mill cases so this is a specialized area I would say this is a niche area of interventional cardiology and uh, you need special uh, expertise to do it. So with this can we avoid uh, bypass in these patients or bypass is a must for all of these patients? No so a lot of these patients uh, if you can handle by uh, by intervention then you do not need bypass because the need for bypass is in two sets of patients. One you say the, the physician, uh, the interventional cardiologist says this artery cannot be handled, cannot be done. Second is uh, there is so much of diffuse disease that we cannot, uh, we give, even if we open the artery there is no, there is no point because the distal artery is so badly diseased that blood would not flow. Okay. So those are the bad worst cases where probably neither bypass nor angioplasty would help. But there are several cases where uh, if it is a, a total occlusion uh, where intervention finds it difficult to do. So, if the, the operator is a CTO operator and he can open it, uh, then you do not need the bypass because okay. the, the outcomes once the arteries are opened are almost as good as, as. opening a uh, regular native lesion okay. and with today's technology of the improved stent technology. So, what will be your key message for current young physicians or young cardiologists oh, who yeah. are dwelling into this kind of area? Well, I would think uh, CTO intervention uh, needs a good understanding of the angiographic image and knowledge and availability of the apt hardwares. True. Because uh, you have to have those hardwares uh, and uh, you have to understand them. And when you do the case, you should always have a work plan or a strategy. There are different strategies anti grade, retrograde, dissection, re entry. So, how the strategies and how you will switch. And while doing the procedure, you need perseverance and patience and long procedures and take long time. And keeping all this still you should be aware and know when to quit because that is sure. very important. Because that is something not very do. important you when know when to, to quit otherwise not to do. When not to do correct. You should know your limits. If you should know your limits otherwise you may spoil. Yes. yes. Okay. Thank you sir. And uh, if the artery is chronically occluded it could still be ischemic. 
okay. produce angina uh, and myocardial ischemia on uh, lab testing.